the window. By Ruskin Bond. Ruskin Bond. Ruskin Bond, an Anglo Indian author, was born on May 19, 1934, in Punjab State's Agency, British India. Was sent to a boarding school in Musoyuri and then to Bishop Cotton School, Shimla. Was sent to his aunt's home in London and he started writing his first novel, The Room on the Roof. Since 1963, he lived as a freelance writer in Mussoorie. He has authored more than 500 short stories, essays, and novels including 50 books for children. Won Sahitya Akademi Award in 1992, Padma Shri in 1999 and Padma Bhushan in 2014. The Window Indicates the story of friendship and the relationship. Expresses the themes of connection, change, and isolation. Explores the pleasant nature. Summary the story is in first-person narrative and the narrator tells that he has taken a room in the top of a building. During spring he arrived there and rented a room and his room alone was there at the top of the building. Through the window in his room he was able to see the world. Opposite to the window there is a banyan tree and he states the inhabitants of that tree. The birds come in morning, the squirrels in the afternoon and the foxes in the night and he used to enjoy the sight. During summer a Tonga arrived with a girl and an old lady, they got down with luggage and entered into a house. The next day the little girl looked up from the garden and saw the narrator who is standing at the window. The little girl is Koki who is about 10 or 11 years old and the narrator greeted her. She asked who are you and he replied that he is a ghost. Mockingly she said that he looks like and thus they started their conversation and he stated that he got up there for a magic. The little girl went to the room and asked about the magic and he took her to the window and showed the world. During those summer days she used to visit his room daily and they both enjoyed the world through the window. They had huge excitement during the rain watching the world outside through the window. They saw women rushing to retrieve clothes, cyclist moving fast, man struggling with umbrella and kids frisking naked. At times Koki would run out in the rain and shout and dance. Koki said that the window is like a cinema, stating the window is the screen and the world is the picture. The mangoes in the mango tree got ripened and Koki was in the tree often and they both ate at least five mangoes a day. Koki got an idea of making a garden on the roof. For two days they carried buckets of mud to the roof and made a bed of mud, planted few plants and pumpkin seeds. It rained heavily during the night and the mud was washed away and only the bricks remained. So they returned to the window and they found a bougainvillea climbing in through the window. Koki told not to close the window and let the creeper into the room. The rain ceased and the autumn season arrived. The little girl and the narrator started enjoying the autumn wind and the red leaves on the ground. The narrator watched the sun rise and Koki used to enjoy the sunset and the cloudy reddish sky. One evening Koki said that she is going back and told that she will come next year and asked him whether he will be there. He replied that he is not sure but the window will be there. Next morning the Tonga arrived and Koki and her aunt get into it and went away. The narrator watched the Tonga till it disappeared from his sight. The he pushed away the bougainvillea and closed the window stating that the window would be opened only when the spring and Koki come back. For more videos. Like. Share. Subscribe. Thank you.